Our story is sad. I want to present our story to you. If Oma, you are welcome to this set. Thank you. Can you tell us, the audience, your story? And the idea is, we don't want you to be hopeless. We want you to have a future. And trusting God, there will be somebody listening to your story today that God will touch to help you. Tell us your story, Oma. On the 8th of March, 2010, my dad went to buy fuel in Shabari Corner at Katako. And that is the city of Jos. That is the city of Jos. That's right. When the crisis started in Jos, my mom noticed it very fast. So she called my dad and asked him where he is. He said he's in Shabari Corner buying fuel. She told him to leave the place that the crisis in Jos has started. So when she left her place, because she's, she's selling gari in Katako, she is meant to be a victim, but God saved her life. When she reached home, she can't find my dad, so she tried to call him number. The phone was ringing, but nobody was picking it. She looked for a soldier man to take her there. When they reached there, the car was damaged, and my dad was killed. And the way they killed him, it, was, it, wasn't, it wasn't good at all. It was bad. It was bad. When they brought my dad, I couldn't even recognize my dad because his head, they divided into two. His head was broken into two. was broken into two. And it was very, very bad. We are hit over and over. Some of their stories have brought me close to tears. And it's my prayer that we have enough hearts and hands who said, we can be father to the fatherless. That's what Samamaga Foundation is set out to do.